Hi there and welcome to our channel. Today we're going to show you how to turn this piece of old-fashioned furniture into a beautiful piece of mid-century modern furniture. Our first job is going to be to take the whole sideboard apart. Now we've taken the cupboard totally apart. We've got here the top and the base and the two bits from inside the cupboard and these are the sides and behind me is the back. These are the bits that we're going to use to make the new sideboard. The sideboard is going to be 140 by 50 by 40 centimetres. Everything's cut down to size. This is the top and the bottom and here are the sides and this is the middle wall. And now we're ready to give it all a good sand. We're going to just use a grit paper 80. When that's done, then we're going to um, drill holes in here for the biscuits so that we can join the cupboard together. We're nearly ready to build our cupboard together, but before we do that, we've got to put two grooves in the cupboard on the top and on the bottom so that we can put these sliding doors in. We've had these sliding doors made, especially by a kitchen maker. It just got orange left over because we wanted leftovers. As you know, we always use rests. So we're going to have orange doors on this cupboard.
while we're waiting for the wood glue to dry on the cupboard, we're going to make two runners. These are usually made out of plastic, but because we've got some oak left over, we're going to just make them out of the oak. And they're going to go in the back here in the two grooves that we made. And this is where the doors are going to slide. And we've also got this piece of wood left over. Out of this, we're going to make two door handles for the cupboard. Now the two runners are in, so now what we've got to do is it's in the doors, we've got to make a groove. We're now ready to drill some holes. We've got a template here. We're going to drill four lot of holes so in this side and on this side so that we can put in the shelving for the cupboard. Once we've done that, we've got these door handles to attach to the sliding doors. Once that's done, then we're going to oil the whole, no, we're actually not going to oil this time, we're going to wax the whole of the cupboard. Once we've waxed the cupboard, we're going to add the back onto the cupboard and the legs. This just shows you what you can make out of an old piece of furniture. You can turn it into a beautiful modern sideboard. 
And if you've liked what we've done, then press the like button. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you in a couple of weeks time. Ciao, ciao.